What's up, everybody? It's John Newcomb here, and welcome back to Satisfactory. So I said I was going to make some slight changes uh, since the last time we had played, and I definitely did. Um, so the first thing we're going to do, actually, let me get uh, here and have... We're going to take this off real quick. So we have a lot of progress has been made. I started building my, my gravity-defined walkway. Um, so my primary function, like I was saying on the last episode, is I really wanted to kind of streamline things so that way everybody could kind of see more of what the game is actually about. Um, so we built the three mines up. Um, everything is running through there. Um, and uh, uh, the, uh, the resources are coming through. I'm sorry, I lost my train of thought. The resources are coming through, and we are uh, smelting out our um, ingots. One of these obviously has stopped because it was feeding directly over here to my backup supply, and that is full. Um, we'll deal with that later. So these are now uh, coming through. All my ingots are coming through, pushing and making uh, different things from plates to... I can't really... There we go. Uh, making plates. Plates are then being divided. Um, I'm actually making uh, uh, reinforced plates now. Uh, we're making screws. We're making a whole bunch of different things. Um, the logistics is really not exactly how I want it set up yet. Um, I'm kind of using this as the backup storage area right now. Um, so at least the game can run and I can make materials. Um, this is going to be the power station kind of area back over here. Um, I am making, uh, biofuel, uh, automated now, which is great because, uh, once you start, <laughs> I'm still have not unlocked coal yet. So, um, I, I just pretty much go around. I harvest a bunch of resources. I turn them into, uh, the, uh, biomass comes into here, it's turned into biofuel. Um, and then it's pumped into here to just kind of get us a reserve going. Um, I really feel like that is backwards. And I, I feel like that's that's it's going to irritate me. Sorry, that has to get changed real quick. Um, but one thing I wanted to share with you is that I'm uh, actually here. Um, I have a really cool thing that we get to do today. And I wanted to make sure I get to do it with you guys. Um, we're going to build the space elevator. Um, I'll show you uh, kind of the, some of the things that we unlocked uh, recently. Um, okay, that needs to get hooked up to right there. Okay, I need to put some fuel back in it. There we go. All right, sweet. Um, so, yeah, make sure everything's kind of uniform. All right, so I pretty much went through and I powered and, uh, I kind of powered through and drove, uh, everything forward and got all of the, uh, things we could get unlocked here so far. So the walkways, the jump pads, um, you know, we're not going to mess with these because I feel like I'm going to kill myself. Um, you know, we've got all these different things. Color gun, I haven't even built the color gun yet. Paints, factory buildings, vehicles, the color can be adjusted prior to painting. I haven't even messed with that. But my big thing was I want to get the space elevator built. So... We're actually going to do that right now. So I've been running the game uh, kind of off like where I walked away. So that way we could build the space elevator. So let's actually, I wonder if I can just queue it up. Kachunk. Sweet. All right. So we need to go pick up our resources and then we're going to build the space elevator, which I'm sure is going to take power. Um, but this is how we unlock the next level of uh, research that's available for us because we are kind of maxed out there. Um, three and that's why I always use concrete. That's fine. Iron plates, iron rods, and wire. Um, I do not have the ratios down right. Uh, I know uh, uh, my friend Mulberry Man was talking to me about it. Um, it's the, the ratios are not quite right. So if you see for the iron, so obviously my other two mines over there aren't even running. It's just straight coming out of here. Now, I do know that you get upgraded um, uh, conveyor belt systems that I can put in, like Mark II, Mark III, that kind of stuff. Uh, same thing as Factorio. You get the fast ones, the red ones. Um, we're going to end up doing that here soon. Uh, or hopefully when we get the space elevator built, that'll be something that we can do. Um, okay, so we're going to do... Let me see. So we need 1,500. Dunk, dunk, dunk. There's 1,500. Um, all right. We need some rods. Uh, how many do we need? A couple of hundred. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Ooh, I'm actually I'm low on that, huh? Oh, no. I'm out of space. Um, okay, drop the wood. I don't really need you either. Drop that. I don't care. All right, pick that up. Okay, sweet. Um, so we need... <laughs> just sit there. Um, let's check out the plates. Yeah, so I've been definitely, uh, the production is going to need to be sped up on a lot of these. Um, oh, no, I keep running out of room. Uh, get rid of you. Crank that in there. Uh, you. Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me? Oh. Uh, oh, I see what I did. Okay. Um, hold up. Let's run back over here. Some of these things I can't just drop. You know what I should do? Because I running around. I should just build some more personal storage boxes. Um, however, we're not there yet. Let's just get this done. Oh, it's a giant alien manta ray thing. Uh, oh, I found a cave too, which was kind of sweet. I'll show you guys later on. Um, I, I found this weird looking cave. 
I got to go in and explore. Uh, found some mushrooms. <laughs> I ate them, and it was like the weirdest thing ever. Um, okay, so yeah, let's just hold off on that right there. So there should be enough room for us to do this. I need 50 more, and then we're going to build this. I and Obviously, I'm going to go ahead and assume this takes power, but from what I understand, this is actually a pretty big uh, achievement. In the, not big achievement, but just kind of a cool thing to do in-game. So let's do this. Uh, okay, so one there. Okay, sweet. So we are set. <clears throat> and I really couldn't think of anywhere else good to put it. Like, I looked around, and I was kind of looking at the layout of everything, and power is obviously going to go this way. I mean, I could put it right here. That's actually kind of a cool occasion. Hmm. All right, let's do this. Wow. Oh, it's got all the re... What is that? Okay, so it's got... It's got inputs on it. That's... That's really cool. Is it two-sided? Okay. So actually, we want to build this. Hmm. I'm thinking something kind of like that. Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, here we go. Isn't that cool? It's all flying out of my inventory. Oh, that's so awesome. What? That's really cool. Wow. Oh, what are we doing? What is this? What is this? Oh. Oh, isn't that awesome? Oh, there goes the elevator piece. Look at that. What? That is ridiculous. Oh, it's got the, the, the warning lights on it. That is really, really cool. Okay, can I... I don't even... Wow. I'm going to climb up it. I don't know if you can configure it, but this is... What? Wow, okay, okay. So, Space Elevator Resource Delivery 1 Project Assembly Platform. Okay, Status Load Resources. So, load, Seal, and Send. What is this? This is crazy. Um, okay, so, one good thing is that we're already producing these in mass. So, I might have those almost immediately. The rotors, I have not. I don't... That is bananas. Okay, I'm gonna put that... Actually, no, wait a minute. Give me those back. Oh, no. Are they gone forever? Nope, they're gone forever. Okay, well... Load those in. Okay. So, I... Wow. All right. That's super awesome. So, that must be what the, the conveyor belts are for, so that I can start moving resources automatically. Um, okay. So, let's do this real quick. Let's go take a look over here and see what I have. Because I wonder what it takes to... I can't remember what it takes to make rotors. But I know I'm producing the reinforced plates, which is... Ugh, I have 26? Really? Why is this going so slow? What's, what's the hold up here? Screws. Hmm, okay. We well, you know what I'm going to do then. I'm going to come over here, and then take a box or two of screws, and I'm going to dump it in here. We'll, we're going to work out the logistics problem with that as far as why that's so slow later. Dump that in there. Okay, so you're going to start hammering those out. What do I need to make? Rotors, actually. So I can come here and look at recipes. Rotors are... Iron rods and screws. So, what we should do, honestly, is cancel that storage of them for right now and put another assembler here and do iron rods and screws because iron rods are right there. What are you short on? Nothing. You're just not producing fast enough. Okay. So, I need ingots. Okay. No, no, no. We're going to make this work. Um. Mm, okay, so I think I'm going to reroute some things over here so we can start getting ready to load that up because that is going to be a pain if we don't start working on it. All right, so we need screws, and and that's just backed up. Um, see, so I have a full storage right over there. It's made to me contemplate life decisions. Let's do... See, but you're maxed out, too. I can do it, run another line. Okay, so we're going to run another line right there. So let's do 
this. So we're going to do constructors. Because we need more. I need more cowbell. Um, hold on. Hold up. <clears throat> I'm thinking we're going to move this. Hmm. That's why I didn't put enough room in, and now I'm paying for it. Hold on. My brain is working. So, screws are actually producing at a good rate. That's not the issue. Okay, let's do this. So, go to constructor. Um, and can I fit this in here? Oh, I'm missing any reinforced iron plates. Okay, they're coming at a better rate now, I think. Give me that. Um... Hmm. Might have to move that power pole, which will kind of be a pain in the butt if I have to move it. Um, let me see if I... Maybe I don't. Let's go to Constructor. Um, e -her. Can I put it underneath? No, I can't. Um, hmm. Okay. So... Actually, can I put it right here? I don't know why I'm not using my platform that I built specifically for issues when I'm trying to build stuff like this. Um, okay. Uh, I don't know if that moving that's going to give me enough room. I think it will. Okay, where are you connecting out to? So you're going to that pole. How many things do you have here? Wait a minute. Hold up, hold up. You have four connections? Over there. Oh, okay. You're that pole. Yeah, of course you are. Two, three, four. Okay. Give me this. Everything's going to shut down. Pole. Right there. Okay. Power line from here to there is one. Power line from here to here is... Encroaching others' clearance. That's not good. Urgh, okay. I'll do it. I'll reroute power all over the place just because I don't care at this point. To there, there, to there, there. Who else in that power? To there. Okay, everything's... We good? I feel like I'm missing one. Yeah, you don't have power. I was like, I knew somebody doesn't have power. Sweet. Okay, everybody's back up. All right, so that works there. Put the constructor here. It's not going to fit, is it? You gotta be kidding me. I did all that and it doesn't fit. Really? Oh, okay. <clears throat> no biggie. No biggie. I need a better view. I don't have a good enough view. Let's get up here. Oh. Me up here. Jump up here. I can't make I can't make it. Me up on the ladder. There we go. Alright. So I have kind of a good thing going, but I'm running out of... I should have stretched these out and gone back farther, to be honest, with those storage areas. That would have made a lot more sense. Um, okay, so I'm going to put a... See, I can do it right there. I think I can make that work, too. I think so. Okay, but one thing I'll show you... Before we get too deep into this, let's, let's take a break for a second. Let's back up. All right, so we're going to come back. We're going to deal with this logistics nightmare that's back here. But we did also unlock a bunch of new research that we can do um, from the hub station over here, which is kind of sweet. So let's go see what we have. So, oh, you have to complete phase one. Okay, never mind. I lied. All right, so... Hmm. Hmm. Let's do... So we need to get this going. Um... Actually, you know what I don't like is... I, it's not the game's fault. It's my fault. A giant, awesome space elevator that goes out in the sky. I did not put the tracker up, which I should have done. So I'm going to go run over here real quick and put the tracker up on my HUD so I can see exactly what we're doing. Um, because squirrel. Uh, oh, I can't. Oh, that kind of stinks. Okay, so I need motors and plates. All right. Oop, did I have any biomass drop off? Nope, everything's good. Race fuel should be good. Making it. Yep. Okay. All right. Hmm. I had it. I 
almost had it. Come on. Right there. All right. This is going to get really, really icky. I might have to, I'm going to clean this up later, I think, um, off camera so that we all don't have to sit here and watch and see what's going on with this. Uh, no, no. You come to here, and then you... I don't... I don't know if that's going to work. We're going to give it a shot. Oh, it... Oh. Huh. So just out of curiosity, why would I want that to snap that way? That doesn't even make... Hmm. I have noticed that a couple of times it's done it to me. So obviously, like, I want... See how the, the direction is? I don't know how you... I don't know how you return the direction. Because that's not... No. No, I don't want it that way. Yeah, see, going that way. No. Oh, no, that shouldn't matter. That's a... Sp oh, I'm dumb. Okay, I know what I did wrong. Okay, hold up. Hold up, hold up. Looking at it, I thought it was a different one. So get rid of this. And then let's put in a splitter right here. So we're going to merge everything together. And then I'm going to split it again. Because why not? And you can't make it because I am put it in the wrong spot. Okay. There we go. Three. You go in there. You go in there. You come out. Hook right there. Perfect. Ooh, this is going to be so icky. All right. That goes right there. Um, all right, this. I need for you to start making me... I don't remember what we needed. Um, we need in order to make the motors. Let's see. Rotors. Uh, okay, so I need screws and iron rods. So that was our issue was there. So we're going to have... Uh, let me see. So we're going to build another assembler. Which is going to eat up a butt ton of power. Um, uh, can't afford... Oh, I'm short. Dang it. Okay, let's pull some resources here. Give me... Ooh, that's... Oh, actually, I don't need a ton of those. That's fine. Um, those, and I need rods, which I'm running low on. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go back over to the, the hub, make some some rotors, and get those knocked out. Um, really, and uh, this is going to be one of those things, I think, that once we get the, the first tier of the space elevator going, get some awesome research unlocked, I think that's kind of where it starts... Really taken off. Let's get rotors. I so need you. I mean, I'm, I am just sitting here so I can build some extra ones. It's not that serious. Um, that'll put a good dent in what we need to do for the space elevator. Uh, <laughs> I spent about two or three hours um, kind of messing with this. Obviously, you can see there's still a ton of refinement that needs to be done as far as logistically how, like, my power lines are all over the place. Um, I was working on the uh, walkway to kind of help give a better overview of what I'm doing. Um, I do like the lookout towers. I will tell you, those are pretty awesome. Um, what happened here? Oh, because it's... Sorry. I'm like, wait a minute. Thank you. Okay. And then you're going to make iron rods. Start making those. Sweet. Assembler. Hold on. I'm going to see if I can stretch. I'm going to come out one on here. Not what I wanted. There we go. Okay. Come back to assembler. Hmm. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, I'm also short. Oh, I need those frames. I forgot about the frames. Yeah, those are the new ones that we can make, like reinforced um, steel frames, stuff like that. that I can make. Um, <laughs> this is amazing that I've done. Just pretty much run around and try to figure this out for one video. It's like I said. I, I never said I was good at Factory. I just said that I enjoyed it. Um, modular frames. There we go. One, two, three. Okay. Should be it. Now we should be good. Here we go. Now we're cooking with fire. Um, 
Okay, you're maxed out there. You're maxed out there because I haven't finished anything over there. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. Um, okay. So here, assembler. Perfect. Put it right there. Sweet. Okay. So now we need you to come in this side. And then I believe we need screws, right? This is, I think, what we're going to need. So, uh, like I said, I'm going to kill this line for right now. Let's kill this line. And we're going to do this. Because this is going to kind of start to become the priority here. So you go to there. Okay. That should be it for those. So we need rotors, screws, and poles. Sweet. Start building that. Um, however, everything needs power. So we're going to come up here real quick. We're going to do power lines. And where is my nearest power? So I've got one right there that's maxed out. I thought I planted. Okay, so we have one right here that has... Oh, no, that's not... That's the thing. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay, it's hidden. Um, so we're going to need to put another power pole. So put another power pole. Cool. Three. Uh, sorry. Here to here. Right there. Here to here. Okay, so now that's powered. I don't have power for you. For you. I don't know... Hmm. What do you got over there? You're four out of four. Huh. I hope I get better power management systems, because these power lines... I know I'm not good at it to begin with, but these things suck. Um, actually, let's do this. Idea. Here to here, which is going to limit me later on, but... Here to... I mean, forget it. Just run it there. Okay, sweet. Everything should start slowly coming out. There we go. There we go. Working on you. Six per minute. Super slow, but that's okay. Um, and now comes the fun part. So we're also going to build a storage compartment for these. So this is an organization storage container. And it's going to come out and go under. I think makes sense. I'm so glad I left enough room to kind of move. The Why is this in my way? I can't see anything. Okay. Duke, duke. Just like so. Awesome. And then you, sir, need to come up from there. Wrap right around and just go in there for right now. And I will take care of that later. All right, so we're slowly producing them. But as you can see, there's a lot of uh, small pieces that need to go into this. And there's a lot of logistics and, and understanding these going. This is going to be a nightmare until I get it fixed. And to be perfectly honest, I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to do that yet. I'd be lying to you if I knew. But thank you very much for joining me today. If you enjoyed this video, satisfactory, even just a little bit, go ahead and mash that thumbs up button. It really means a lot to me as a YouTube content creator. Um, if you want to see more or have any suggestions about how I can totally not mess up my power situation, um, please give me a comment down below. Or you can communicate directly with me on my Twitter, which link to that is in the description of this video. And I'll see you here very shortly on another episode of Satisfactory. Take care, everybody.